Performance USA, the greatest entertainers in America, is requested by you, the fighting men of the United States Armed Forces throughout the world. This weekly radio program is governed by your letters. Joe Jeep commands in the War Department of Bays. Anything from a song by Judy Garland to the sizzling sound of a sirloin steak. As this program is being performed in a Hollywood studio, a master recording is made from which transcripts will be shipped to Army and government-operated stations all over the world. Strictly for you men overseas, no matter how small your outfit. And speaking of little things and trivia in general, here's old General Trivia in person. Your commanding officer of this command performance, your old sidekick and chief scout of the Wolf Patrol, Bob Hope. <laughs> Very much. Thank you. How do you do, fellas? This is Bob. This is Bob Command Performance Hope telling each Nazi that's in Russia today that Crimea doesn't pay. <laughs> <laughs> I'm now getting my material from H.V. Coltenborn. <laughs> well, I'm a little tired tonight. I just got back from Camp Roberts, drove down 200 miles in a Jeep. Tomorrow I get the order of the Purple Callus. <laughs> But I had a swell time, and I slept right in the barracks last night with the boys. You know what barracks are. That's 2,000 cots separated by individual crap games. <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, let's hit the harmony trail to all APO and FPO numbers. For Fletch, Alfie, and Dooley, and for all of you everywhere, the girl who can diffuse a blockbuster with one kiss, Miss Betty Hutton. Hiya, fellas, and hello, Bob. Well, hiya, Betty, and say, I want to congratulate you on your big hit in our new picture. It's nice to see a youngster coming up. It's nice to see an oldster holding his own. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's fine. And now, Betty, as one of the three flying Huttons, will you answer a slew of command performance requests and strafe us with that 50 caliber tune, He Says Murder, He Says. <laughs> Finally found a fella Almost completely divine But his vocabulary Is killing this romance of mine We get into an intimate Situation And then begins this Romeo's conversation he says murder, he says, every time we kiss. He says murder, he says, at a time like this. He says murder, he says, is that the language of love? He says solid, he says, takes men in his arms. He says solid, he says, meaning all the charms. He says solid, he says, is that the language of love? He says chick, chick, you torture me, zoop. Are we living? I'm thinking of leaving him flat. He says dig, dig, the jump, the old ticker is given. No, he can complain of the mad. He says murder, he says. Every time we kiss, he says murder, he says. Keep it up like this and that murder, he says. In that impossible door, we'll bring on nobody's murder but his own. He says Jackson, he says. And my name's Marie, says Jackson, he says. Shoot the snoot to me, says Jackson, he says. Is that the language of love? He says, whoa, whoa, he says. When he lights my hat, he says, he says, what the heck is that? He says, whoa, whoa, he says. Is that the language of love? He says, pep, pep, we're helium now, babe, we're cooking. And all their expressions to it. He says, we're into groove, and the groove is good looking. He sounds like his upper stone fit. He says, murder. Yes, sir, a vitamin pill with legs. How about that? <laughs> Thanks, Betty Hutton. 
and also the 370th Army Air Force Band of the San Bernardino Air Service Command. Well, gang, command performance has filled many an order for those sounds that remind you of home, from the bleat of a billy goat to the fizz of a bourbon and soda. And now comes the ordnance gang at 863 with a letter from Sarge Everett Hankey and Corporal Roland Lipton and this little dilly. It says, Dear Command, in close, please find peace off top of Stuka Dive Bomber, for which you will please have Lana Turner come out and fry us a three-inch porterhouse steak smothered with onions, and let's hear it sizzle. Just to prove there's no request too large, fellas, here she is, Lana Turner. And hi, Bob. Say, have the FBI men found a steak yet? Yes, it's backstage. But, Lana, <laughs> this is dangerous. If this audience sees steak, they'll come right up here after it. Oh, I don't know. They've seen ham all evening, and you're still here. <laughs> right now, I'm bacon. <laughs> Let's get out with this thing. Be a good girl and let's fry that steak, huh? Okay. Bring on the porterhouse steak! <laughs> well, look, they got an armed guard around the steak. <laughs> hey, pal! Oh, look at this. <laughs> well, all right, Bob. Is your griddle hot? Yeah, my, I think so. My, oh, my... Oh, <laughs> that, that'll do, Bob. Now, the steak, please. Oh, uh, well, here it is, fellas. Porterhouse steak, three inches thick. The yeah. only one in captivity. You're gonna give that a hot foot? Into the frying pan. <laughs> oh, no. Oh, yes. There you are, fellas. That's the sound of a steak sizzling. Fellas, that's the steak. That's not me sizzling. That's the steak. <laughs> and, fellas, I wish I could cook a big steak for each and every one of you. <laughs> But now, for the whole AEF, for the Army nurses and Red Cross girls, civilian workers on the fighting fronts, and for the 512 gang who signed themselves Squarehead Bakowski, Cyclops Sink, Body Meeks, Stuka Martin, Incendiary Stasi Wahi, and Sad Sack Jack. Here's one of your all-time sweethearts, another command performance for that lovely sweater girl, Judy Garland. Hiya, fellas. Sweater girls. Bob, why are men so crazy about sweater girls? I don't know, Judy. That's one mystery I'd like to unravel. <laughs> <laughs> fellas, one of your favorite combinations. Judy Garland singing Over the Rainbow. the rainbow 
If happy little bluebirds fly beyond the rainbow, why, oh, why can't I? Thanks, Judy. Thanks from America. To all our men in blue, our boys in khaki too, our tough marines, our coast guard, our army nurses true, we thank you so much. And thanks to our brave allies, the gallant Russian bear, the British everywhere, the free French and the Chinese and you Latins way down there. We thank you so much, fellas. This doesn't rhyme. One of these days soon, we'll be seeing you. In the meantime, this is Bob Hope thanking you for those letters to Command Performance, Armed Forces Radio, Los Angeles, USA. Speaking for everybody on Command Performance and saying the best of the best in the USA. So long. <laughs> She's on her way, men. From us to you, every week till it's over, over there.